hi guys welcome back to my channel um today i'll be sharing a recipe that is most requested by some of my friends and family and um the recipe is about hot spicy chicken wings and drumstick and i'll be sharing this recipe with all of you so so let's start by cutting the edges of the chicken wings and wash them thoroughly put them in a bowl where I'll start marinating them with apple cider vinegar. The next item I'll be using is chili garlic sauce. That's the main ingredient that will make it spicy and tasty. So uh, for this recipe, I'm using two pounds of chicken wings and two pounds of uh, drumstick. So uh, first I added teaspoon of vinegar and then I added two tablespoon of um, chili garlic sauce now you see that uh, we are moving over to our drumstick uh, first you have to wash it completely and then and making these cuts just like you see in the video um, we are doing this because we want the marination to penetrate thoroughly into the drumstick yeah. To make the paste for the marination of drumstick, I'll be using 2 tablespoons of apple cider vinegar and 2 tablespoons of soya sauce and 1 tablespoon of chili garlic sauce. Now we will add our spices. I am okay. using one half teaspoon of salt and teaspoon of garlic and teaspoon of ginger powder. Mix it all together, make a paste and apply it on your drumstick and you will be marinating it for 30 minutes. To make it more juicy and tender from inside, this is how we do it. Just follow the instruction on the video. So putting it on 405 degree, cook it for half an hour and then you will cook it another 20 minutes after applying the coating. So now you will prepare your coating and for coating you will use 1 tablespoon of honey, 3 tablespoon of um, buffalo sauce and also add um, salt as per taste and mix it all together. So after 30 minutes take out your drumstick and chicken wings and apply the coating on all the pieces.
so after applying the coating um, they need to go back in the oven and keep it there for another 20 to 25 minutes guys they taste really good it's a very easy simple recipe and if you follow all the instructions they will turn out really good i hope you try this recipe and let me know in the comment how do you like it thank you so much for watching and come back for more videos bye